Yeah, what's up? What's up, guys? This is Blogger Flani. Uh, remember, today we're at Varsity and we're trying to cover a few topics that happened through this week. So, as your host today, I want to cover something that has been really on my mind uh, ever since the week started. So, we have this whole case of uh, Hype Balo. I know you guys know Hype Balo. Hype Balo is actually um, a hype man for DJ John Falmi. And if you hear the name of DJ John Falmi, it's been chaotic. Uh, just a few weeks uh, back, we had the whole murder case that was pinned against him and his team. So it was reported all over the newspapers that uh, uh, the DJ and his um, team were actually uh, responsible for the murder of that police at Kabete, uh, uh, that uh, came from Kabete police station. So uh, it's been a whole challenging experience for the whole team. And then uh, just recently, John Falme was actually released uh, from jail. And now the remaining fact is that his hype man, hype balo, is actually uh, still being held by the police. So it's a whole case, and uh, I know it's sad, it's something that we have to talk about. But then something that I really like to focus on is actually the bail money or the legal fees that I've seen going around where people are actually contributing to the to the um, coverage of the uh, legal fees. So it gets to a point where I normally ask myself that uh, we've gotten to a point where in the entertainment industry is actually very difficult for us to afford to pay these expenses that come up along the way. So here, for example, is Hype Balo needing legal fees. Hype Balo has been in the industry for a while. He is actually a hype man for DJ John Falmi. So if it was me, because I've seen the amount of shows that DJ Falmi, DJ John Falmi always gets, uh, it's actually way too much. Okay, Umsi Anakwanga shows like everywhere. Like he was released from jail, and the next day he was actually on a show. Ah, yeah. uh, I don't know if it's next month or the month after. Uh, he's actually on a show with uh, DJ Chris Darling. Okay, one and So this is a guy who has plenty of money. And if you have plenty of money as a DJ, your team also needs to have that kind of money. So it's a case that I've been going on for a while. It's just a phenomenon that always happens. Whenever a celebrity gets into trouble, there's always a pay bill number, which is very disappointing. For me personally, as Blogger Flyney, it's very disappointing because I'm expecting as a celebrity, as someone who is in the game, someone who is all over the place doing shows here and there. As a hype man, you're also getting paid. Si semi hype balo anafanya for free. No, hakuna kitu free. This is business. At the end of the day, you're trying to get money from this. Okay? So I don't understand the whole pay bill number thing. I have never understood it even up until now. Someone gets cancer, someone needs treatment, someone needs uh, barrier re- arrangements, even for the uh, Brian Shira thing. We still did the same. There was a pay bill number. People came up, people were uh, doing... What will come chango? Okay, so CLAW, CLAW is story mchango every now and then. Celebrity, and I get, they get into trouble, mchango, mchango. It's actually very disappointing because as an entertainer, as someone who has been in the entertainment industry and also commenting a lot to do with entertainment industry, and uh, it's just something that I'm really, really disappointed, okay, because I'm expecting you guys are making money, okay? So coming at as I do, I don't know. It's just disappointing when I begin seeing pay bill numbers all over the place. So I wish Balo all the best. I hope he gets through this case because it's a very serious case. But I'm just hoping that in the near future, Mazi, is it easy to to afford because we're making money from it, okay? Let's, let us afford these things. So this has been Blogger Flani. That's just uh, my take of the week. Uh, and uh, remember, we are at Varsity. Follow us at varsity.co.ke. That's our website, Varsity Kenya, all over the place, Instagram, Facebook. You guys find us there. Keep following our pages, Mase, because we're bringing more content towards you. So cheers, and I'll see you next time.